I want to offer a quick reflection about the importance of loving our loved ones and those nearest to us during these times. There's lots of uncertainty and there's lots of unknowns seemingly lurking around about to pounce on us. But the reality is that we control how we act with our loved ones and how much love we show to them. So in that spirit, let us pause and recall that we're in the loving presence of God. Okay. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Spirit Santo. Amen. This Monday was the feast day of St. Matthew the Apostle, a Jewish tax collector who was hated and reviled by most around him. But an invitation from our Lord made all the difference, and he did follow him. I ask us to consider another, another invitation, to love God with all our heart, mind, and soul, and to love our neighbor as ourself, and to remember that in doing so, we help build up the body of Christ. Here's a short prayer uh, from Saint, for St. Matthew the Apostle. We thank the Heavenly Father for the witness of your Apostle and Evangelist Matthew to the Gospel of, of thy Son, our Savior. And we pray that after his example, we may with ready wills and hearts obey the calling of our Lord to follow him through Jesus Christ our Lord, who liveth and reigneth with thee and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Today we pray for all those affected by the pandemic and for any intentions in your heart. St. Peter Faber, St. Francis Xavier, and St. Ignatius of Loyola, pray for us in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Have a wonderful day, Brophy.